Hey guys, Doomer Days here. I uh, just wanted to bring y'all uh, the UI that I've been currently working on, basically. And uh, it's kind of like just basically taken from my old uh, GUI that uh, is on my Steam channel. Um, and if you look in there, you'll see it. It's the old one. Of course, it, it does work and it will load, but you won't get what you should get you won't get the same ui so chances are it will crash the game if you try to use it but uh i did manage to get it to load but what i did is i've been working on the new one and taking some of the old icons bringing them into the new interface and this and that and the other some old some new some new and some old uh I've also taken some of the older icons back in the day that I had on an old archive that I had and popped some of the icons out of there, used those as well. So you'll see that across the UI as well. Uh, but a bunch of icons have changed. Uh, I'll show you that right now. Uh, you, you got the same interface, okay. The only difference is that, I, that I'm trying to figure out, I can't seem to find uh, I know that it's in there somewhere. It is in the UI under the uh, uh, base under material and then from material under UI and then from under UI is, is a directory called window. And I'm assuming that that is, the, you see the black there where the icons sit on, if, if, if you will. What I'm trying to do is make that a little bit more transparent where it's not so black, where it would be a little bit more, you know, transparent. If anyone knows where that is in the the black that you see on the, you know, that the icons sit on, please let me know in the description down below to where that is because I can't seem to find it. I have... Trans I made the uh, in that directory material UI window directory inside of that folder there's there's files in there that that I'm assuming that deal with this window or that black that you see um, so if anyone knows let me know so I can make it a little bit more transparent but for some reason it just doesn't want to seem to take effect so i must be missing something somewhere or whatever but anyway without further ado let me go ahead and show you some of the interface that i haven't redesigned the interface so to speak but all the icons are in color like i said some old some new some are still based off of whatever scf has in there because i haven't really found an icon that's suitable or so i just left it kind of default uh, with the, either the old icons or some of theirs, but I have replaced quite a few of my own from the older uh, GUI that I made a while back. And if you look on there, you'll see that the windows on that one was a little more transparent, you know, where it's not so black. But let me know, like I said, let me know if you know any, any way to get around that. Uh, it'd be grateful for uh, your kindness and your help on that. Uh, but anyway, uh, what I've done is uh, I've changed the icons. Here's your system power button, uh, desktop backgrounds, load and save, options, title, and quit have been changed. Uh, the media icon here has been changed. Uh, you got radios changed. All these in here have been changed. Uh, catalog, all these in here pretty much have been changed, except I think this one is the old one and uh some of these are new like i said there's some here uh, in here under company uh, under career these have been changed under convoys have been changed uh, i think one has been changed i don't remember if i changed both or not uh, like i said some are old some are new and uh navigations have been changed except for quick travel i think i left that one default and then under jobs, uh, you've got your contracts and your freight market, your cargo and quick and so on. And then a new drive button. And then if you hit R on the keyboard to go to your radio, you'll see the radio here. You know, just like all that's the same. Uh, change the icon here. The, these are changed icons under music player as well. You'll see these icons here have been changed. 
uh, if you go to your options and you go down to your icons down here have been changed graphics have been changed to a to a desktop monitor audio has been changed to just a audio icon gameplay it shows a computer with a monitor your interface your key keys and buttons are just up and down arrow it's just something simple controls is a wheel online is configuration for online and then accessibility under radio or audio i've changed icons here as you can see uh, gameplay i don't think i changed anything there the interface hasn't been changed as far as anything else goes but see how black all that is i'd like it to be more transparent a little bit keys and configuration are pretty much the same controls are all the same your online is all the same and accessibility is all the same but this window could be a little bit more transparent and i'm not sure where that's at it's a little bit transparent but i'd like it to be a little bit more if, if anyone knows, let me know where, I, where these back windows are. I don't really know where they are. I thought I had found them, but apparently not. But anyway, guys, uh, there you go. There's some nice little new icons for you. Uh, everything pretty much works the same. There's your map background. Uh, I think I'm in Colorado Springs at the moment. All this is default DLC, uh, except I haven't bought Arkansas. But Arkansas yet over here. I haven't bought it yet. I think what is that right here or right here somewhere right there Anyway, I hadn't got that one yet. I'll get that one this weekend But uh, anyway, uh, and then down here, you'll see these icons down here have been changed uh, But you know uh, It can go out for beta testing or something pretty soon if, if, if everybody's liking it and and they get enough likes and some comments on the video and everything and let me know uh, like i said on these windows uh, especially especially the front right here this part of the, the ui right here these these i don't like it to be so black you know it would be nice if it was a little bit more transparent but let me know if you want it to be like that let me know if not it can stay like this uh, let me know if there's any other icons or if you have some icons that you want to add in there Let me know and I can send them over to me and I'll try to get them in uh, But for now guys, uh, I think that's pretty much gonna do it uh, Also, too you have a new the new logo that that you know with the girls on the front when you load up the game uh, you, If you load if you go in here and like save game or load game or whatever You'll, if you do the auto saves, you'll see the new icon there. The generic one is also there. If you go into, I think it's under save, if I'm not well. Can't do it from there, but they are there. Uh, so those uh, new load icons and that stuff there. Um, let me see. Also, you'll notice that the icons up here are also pretty much the ones down here. Uh, they have also changed. Uh, you, you can see those icons look pretty nice. See, that could be a little bit more transparent on the window. Uh, I just don't know where they are. If someone, like I said, could help me out and direct me into the right folder. Uh, I've got the archive or the base game and everything extracted, but I can't seem to find those windows or wherever they are. I don't know. Something that controls something. But anyway, it still looks good nonetheless. And uh, anyway... Uh, hope you guys like it. Let me know what you think about it. And uh, like I said, leave comments and, and, and all that. Uh, and we'll see about getting it released and uh, let you guys try it out. See if you like it or not like it or whatever. And uh, we'll go from there. Uh, there's only a few other things. I've been testing it. Uh, seems to work pretty decent as far as I can tell. I haven't had any issues with it. Um, I just prefer, I don't prefer the black and orange, like, you know, on SES by default, I like a little more color in my icons. I think they look better. Uh, I would, I don't, I'm not really fond of the UI that they've designed. Uh, they could have come up with a little bit of something more, <laughs> more, uh, up to modern standards per se, I guess. I mean, it's, you know, I mean, I'm not saying that the UI is not bad. It, or is not you know is not great but 
they could have done something a little bit different and made it, you know, get off of that orange and black, orange and black, orange and black. But anyway, you know, I'm not going to rant on about that. The UI is still nice. Uh, SCS has done a great job. Um, I would still like to see something different than, than what, you know, this is just something simple. I think I like the old UI better than I do this UI. Uh, but anyway, guys, uh, hope you enjoy it and let me know what you think about the, uh, about the icons and things like that. Uh, if there's something that, that, that you want to see that I can probably implement or try, let me know. Uh, like I said, do keep in mind, the main priority is just a little more transparent on the background that the icon, that the icon set on. That would be, instead of just being kind of black would be more, you know, more like a, you know, like a transparent window, so to speak. But anyway, guys, that's enough of that. And uh, anyway, I'm going to leave you with that and hope you like it and enjoy it. Uh, let me know down in the comments down below. Uh, if we can get a release out, it will be on the Steam channel here pretty soon and you'll be able to grab it. Uh, I will post the information in there whenever I do decide to release it, if and when. Uh, but once I get more comments and likes on it, and maybe some information about where this, this black background is and all that, uh, we might get us a release out. But anyway, guys, enjoy, have fun, happy trucking, and as always, catch you in the next video. Doomer Days is out. Peace!